This respected member of the Jedi High Council and general in the Clone Wars was a true defender of the Jedi Order and all that it stood for. Although he fought valiantly for the Grand Army of the Republic, Master Windu was never comfortable with how the Jedi and the Senate had become so deeply intertwined. Luke Skywalker Windu eventually continued training under the guidance of Yoda. Prior to the invasion of Naboo, Windu became involved in theater for a time and was taught to act the works of Harido Kavila by Jedi Council member, Alsha Kress. Later, he would achieve the rank of Jedi Master and gained a seat on the Jedi High Council, the governing body of the Jedi Order. Long regarded as the Jedi Order's greatest champion, Windu endeavored to maintain the Jedi's ancient traditions while the Republic declined due to galactic unrest and political corruption. As one of the most distinctive members of the Order, Windu crafted a new lightsaber which, in addition to its specially designed handgrip and electrum finish, indicating his status as a member of the High Council, also emitted a plasma blade of amethyst, making it one of the most distinctive Jedi weapons. During one of his missions, Windu rescued Deepa Bilaba and Sa Labuda from pirates and brought her to the Jedi Temple on Coruscant where he trained her to become a Jedi Knight. By 40 BBY, Bilaba was serving on the High Council alongside her former master. In the Jedi Temple, as a knight and then master, Windu gave lessons about letting go and trusting in the Force. 